Please be advised that the views and opinions of the hosts and guests do not reflect those of the station, the management, and its network. Ayan, you're still watching Millennial TV. Balikan natin yung question ni Waki sa ating guest. Ano nga yung question mo, Waki, kanina? Okay, sige. I-ano natin, ha, para sa mga hindi na nakakasunod dun sa topic. I-recap muna natin yung ating topic for the day, which was yung mga places that uh, no longer exist real or imagined from childhood or otherwise kakademolish lang and you've heard uh, a lot of answers like uh, mga malls, mga clubs, mga other tourist destinations. Mm-hmm. So yun nga, yun, napunta tayo sa ilalim ng dagat at napag-usapan <laughs> yung uh, Atlantis. And mm-hmm. Because this is something that you really believe in, uh, like it exists, and I guess like it exists before. And I guess to tie it back to the topic, uh, a lot of us mentioned the places na we mentioned because we have a nostalgia factor for it. Yeah. Obviously, you haven't been to Atlantis, so dapat walang nostalgia. But here's the funny thing with like the research I've been doing. Mm. A lot of the scientists and a lot of like the credible speakers about mm-hmm. the topic, a lot of them, and again, you do not have to believe this, but a lot of people that speak up about Atlantis okay. right now and all of these lost cities, they claim to be reincarnated from that supposedly superior race. Mm-hmm. So my question, Adrian, is is this coming from a place of nostalgia? And if so, do you believe you're a transcendent being from that lost city of Atlantis? <laughs> reincarnated now for Zara to love. <laughs> yeah, I, I wish, no, but no. But actually, uh, my interest in the topic of uh, Atlantis and... Uh, uh, a lot of uh, mythological topics mm-hmm. as well so because of my love for video games because when I was a kid mm-hmm. oh, I played yeah. a lot of actually t- till now I play a lot of God of War anyway so in ang hirap ng yung last locations game, ang hirap. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. you know that yeah. <laughs> a lot of them are maps, really yeah. based din naman yeah. kasi on uh, mga itong mga myths and legends mm-hmm. Lang, mm-hmm. of course yung video game has their own mm-hmm. interpretation yeah. But yun nga eh, parang babalik tayo dun sa bigger topic na parang at what point do we say that these are just myths? Could there be like deeper meaning behind it? Kasi parang, and again, Ik- Ikaw, uh, uh, yeah. I'll put the question on sure. you. Like parang, feeling mo ba transcendent ka ng someone from no. the Atlantis? Kasi you're very, very passionate, which yeah. is, no, very Good seldom question. natin makita no, no, no. si Waki of very, no, no. very, like, Pasyon, into the topic. Pasunod so, na mo na lagi, grabe ka. Yeah, yeah, but... <laughs> Except for, for love. For life. this one, yeah. <laughs> wow, like, you parang, actually went there. Uh-huh. When did it start? Yung, yung fas- fascination mo sa lost city or sa mga mythological places like that? Yun nga, I, I think pareho kami na, yun nga, video games. Video, Ako, video games. games okay. Pero in my case, I ended up deep diving into, and I'm giving away my age here, encyclopedias. Oh, okay. Wala mm-hmm. pang internet. So, I, there, I mean, there's really uh, mm-hmm. certain level of interest naman talaga. Yeah. And syempre, I guess the older you get, the more you read about yeah. it. And then you start making this association sa parang, is it really that fake true, if there's true, like true. enough evidence to point? Kasi parang, the way they're told kasi could be, yes, subject to uh, artistic interpretation, mm-hmm. pero the source material of it might just be yeah. real. Kasi how correct, did it correct, get correct. to us right now as stories if nobody passed it on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right? And then, I, I guess where I'm coming from here, and to answer your question is, no, I don't think naman I'm one of those enlightened beings from mm. Atlantis. <laughs> yeah. Having said that, yun nga eh, parang if it, if by the end of our lives, and dito tayo pupunta sa belief ng afterlife, if by the end of the lives, like whoever judges us on the other side, tells me na I was once upon a time from uh, Atlantis nga, it's something that I'm ready to accept. I mean, yeah. I, I don't obsess over it na parang oh, I'm of four percent. That's gonna make you look stupid. Mm-hmm. But yun nga, I mean, do I, is it a feasible thing na if somebody told me na parang reincarnation was real and mm-hmm. some of us are like, souls from a past life, then, yeah, why not? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, you know, is it really that far-fetched if you're coming then from a point of religion where a lot of religions mm-hmm. have some form of reincarnation, mm-hmm. right? Mm-hmm. So, is it really still that far-fetched mm-hmm. yung mga sinasabi nilang nabubuhay ngayon? I, I think as, as long as what you believe in makes you a better person or helps you, like, you know, cope or, or, or anything like that. Because I, 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 have, I have friends who also believe na 
Kasi ako, I believe there are aliens. Or I mean, there are really? uh, civilization in other planets other, or something yeah. like that. For other people, no, that's impossible. This is Earth kasi ito lang yung yeah. survival and all. But you know, like, as long as it doesn't harm you na parang baliw ka na or yeah. anything, like parang I you don't judge people yeah. because they don't believe what you believe in. Yeah. I think don't there's just no problem with that. Don't judge people for what you don't Yeah, kasi, don't because some people, people na weirduhan yeah. or na, na mm. awkward na sila pag, pag if you become so passionate about something na parang they don't believe in that. Yeah. Parang yung Atlantis or anything. Parang isip na, isip pata naman nito, na naniniwala pa rin sa ganyan. I get it a lot. I mean, not that I <laughs> yes. care. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I mean, I guess the stubborn part of me Correct, correct. Is the person that started getting into all of the research. May inner childhood <laughs> pare na involved jan. And so again, let's just make it readable for everybody. Para at least nintay sobrang, you know, out of this world. De ba? Ang concept nga ni Adrian Tiria, these are transcendent beings. Mm-hmm. Let's ask ourselves, parang, whatever, wherever we are at our life right now, don't we all just wanna transcend our current existence, whatever that means for you? Do you? Don't, don't you all? Don't we all? Do you? Say, si Adrian Muna. Do you feel like within this life, there's a need for you to transcend to something higher? Um, well, honestly, for me, I'm, uh, currently I've been thinking na, because uh, uh, one of the things me and Zara would love to talk about is if you would have a superpower, what, it, <laughs> yeah, what, yeah, what would yeah. it be? Right. And then Zara <laughs> would always say, uh, teleport, stop no, time, yeah. mm-hmm. right? <laughs> And then I would always say, I just want to be an intellectual and creative genius, just so para you know I could live a comfortable life. So mm. I don't know. For myself, parang I'm not keen on you know transcending into a higher right. being because I feeling ko ane eh, the joys of mortality yeah. ane eh, it. Fades away, because yeah. for example, if you believe there is tra- transcendent beings, transcendent, ah, yeah. transcendent yeah. beings, let's say they're immortal, let's say they don't mm-hmm. feel no pain, then you won't enjoy the thrill of let's say Life. skydiving, yeah. traveling. Yeah. Yeah. So there's no more risk. Correct. There's no risk of dying. Yeah. So. And but coming from where you said, guy, na parang yung you want to be, you say more creative or yeah. parang more Genius. imaginative. Yeah. Yeah. Doesn't transcendence cover that also? What if lang, again, for the sake of argument, let's say Atlantis was real. What if there was information there that you can practice? So this isn't like witchcraft, what if there were actual scientific studies within that lost city that'll help you get to that transcendent quote-unquote level where you're more creative? Wouldn't you want access to that if it was available? Well, yeah, I think I would. Um, Pero... To that point, lang siguro, not to the, not to an extreme transcendent being. But yeah, as you mentioned it, yeah, I'll be, you know, di naman ako tatangge. Salamat na lang. Ikaw ba siya ng superpower na gusto mo? Ay superpower mo? Ako? Ano ba? Hmm. Siguro ano na lang? Lipad na lang? Ano sa? Ato, ato alam ko lipad kasi gusto ng gusto mag uh, travel. Travel. Oh, yeah. Alam mo ang, ang gusto ko yung napanood ko yung movie na Jumper. Gusto ko ganun din. Ano yung Jumper? Ano kapag teleport ka? Yan yung ano eh. Si ano kan yung video. Or yung invisibility cloak. Ay yo. Stop ah, time or rewind or Tapos I will steal one. Oh yeah. Yeah, you know. Sabi ko nga, sabi ko kay Ish. I want to stop time and get clothes from the mall. Did I when we were when we were kids parang then ito, magsisinungaling kayo kung hindi nyo in-imagine na magiging Inisip. invisible. And then pumunta kayo doon sa... Oo nga! Di ba yung mo mag-spy kayo doon sa mga crush nyo or anything? Or mag- makapasok kayo kasi may entrance yung ganitong place. So, kung invisible ka na makakalusot ka. Kasi that sa mga is, movies, ba? That is so wrong! At, oh my... I'm not saying it's you, ha? Pero yung mag- you're gonna use your power to like... Beat? Oh my... Oh wow! Like entrance yeah. ng ano, ng, ng for concert. example, cinema, oh. concert. Oh, 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 oh. Go, so, go, there's, something with the, there's something wrong with you. <laughs> In a good way though. Anyway. No, but yun, yeah, but speaking of yun, I, I think lahat tayo, yung, yung childhood natin, kasi it's very, very colorful because hindi pa nga ganun yung technology. That's why yeah. nakakalabas tayo. And then yeah. we get to absorb lahat. Like, you, you know, lahat ng mga senses natin talaga nung gumagana. Unlike yung mga tablets na lang. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Iba yung inspiration natin, iba yung creativity. So, yung mga places na na-visit natin before and then ngayon wala na siya, yeah, we miss the structure, probably, the colors and all that. But, yeah, yung sinabi mo kanina, it's actually the feeling of 
being there, especially the, mem the memories that we made uh, with the people that we were there with mm. during the time. Diba? Kasi nga ngayon, hindi na ganun ka connected yung mga tao kasi very virtual. You know what? So, I would it. give up every superpower in the world to be able to turn back time. Okay. Honestly. Mm, yeah. Like, kunyari, oh, superpowers yung topic, diba? may laser vision ka, may super strength yeah. ka, ang guapo mo, ang baho, nung, ang bango ng utot mo. You know what I mean? You can have all of that, but you know, I would trade that to like yeah. turn back time. What if mo babalik mo yung oras pero yung age mo ganyan pa rin? Okay lang. Kasi inaalagaan naman natin sarili natin eh. So I have no issues showing up as a 17 year old. Like if I had that option na if God drops me off randomly, mm -hmm. I think I can handle 17 year old me. And wouldn't you wanna go back to your 17 year old selves? Lalo na yung mga nasa 30s na. What if? Ako if I could go back in time and restart somewhere, I'll start at 17. Different topic, and yeah, I would restart at 17. Mm -hmm. But yeah, I think uh, it should be encouraged yung, uh, to have interest in, for example, Atlantis or uh, uh, so things that don't exist in fantasy. Because uh, life is boring kapag focus ka masyado sa careers, yeah. uh, oh. you know, and it stimulates, mm -hmm. you know, creativity, creativity. and... Uh, yeah, yeah, we don't, you don't necessarily have to believe it naman, hook, line, and sinker, but uh, I guess just that essence of like what if what if what if and yeah. yung feeling lang na parang oh my goodness this is yeah. knowledge that nobody else knows yeah yeah you know what i mean ako you keep on asking oh, why and then yeah uh, ako may nephew ako diba na almost then parang on youtube it's very accessible kasi yung mga what if yung mga yeah. ganun, it, it, it's Be sparks careful the, then eh, with it sparks the information. parang curiosity mm -hmm. or something like that and then the more you research kasi about the past uh the more you know about it the more you don't repeat those bad things that na na, na oh, have before. Like, yeah. merong pi may picture before na parang very ancient, and then sabi nung mga comments na, na parang, ah, oh, I wish I, I, I was living in that era da, or in that, mm. ano. And then, they're, they're very clueless na kung nabubuhay tayo nung panahon na yun, I slave know. tayo. Yeah, yeah. Kasi we're Asians, yeah. and then, uh, minsan, yung mga ganon, yung may year, hundreds of years of slavery, those are the things that I'll cover up because you know, they get a lot of people who have pyramids and all, yeah, like, yeah, yeah. With mga kids yeah, who and who put mga those ano? things up <laughs> there? Yeah, yeah, have yeah. you ever stopped to think? Like, the standard belief kasi is like there are slaves, like Moses, diba? Yeah. Correct, they pulled correct, correct. that thing and built that. Like, how would you with yung supposedly? Yung Stonehenge, alam mo. Isa pa yun, oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. They were all over the world, yeah. Oh. Yung Stonehenge. Yeah, Maraming Stonehenge. Stonehenge kasi, parang the accepted theory is that it might have been a religious site. Mm -hmm. But I think uh, the good thing about a lot of these uh, ancient civilizations, yada yada na rethinking what we think about the ancients, is that, and I hate to end the show on a grim note, is that diba Atlantis disappeared over time, right? And we're assuming it's a natural disaster. What some experts are saying is that Atlantis tried to warn us ahead because it might may come again. So we have to be ready really? just in case diba? something else swallows our civilization. Excited. And it repeats itself. <laughs> it repeats itself. Kasi, like, what if some tribe survived na walang technology? It's just gonna happen all over again. Mm, yes. So, you, I, I think it's just food for thought as yeah. we head yeah. into the end of I, I the topic. I think sooner or later we're all gonna be part of history and what we create right now, uh, let's make sure na yung mga future generation meron pa silang aabutan. That's why, yeah, yeah we are doing you know, commercialization and industrialization. But yun, yeah, as much as possible, protect the environment or, you know, yes. save the earth. Yes. Para yes. Meron pang thousands of years na mga mabubuhay na ma 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 mahukay man nila itong sofa na to, they would know that, you know, may Makati, may office here oh, before. Oh, may <laughs> TV dito dati. Yes, yes. exactly. I mean, that is something parang we, we don't live forever. Like, you know, some of us wish yeah. we could have, but, you know, that's the fact. So, I, I think that's it. Y yung parang it's okay to reminisce about the past, but, you know, look forward and learn the future and make sure na meron meron din uh, better future for the kids. Especially ngayon, yung anak ni Yulabay. Anak yes. ni Sada. Uh -oh. May ibang mabalikan, no? <laughs> yes, go ahead, Sarah. Ayan, guys. Um, really? I think this I'm is just an episode where I'm just listening to you guys and just learning. Bring him again next time, ha? <laughs> 
Ayan. Yeah. Oh. Thank you so much for being here. Yeah, yeah. Thank, thank you guys. guys. Thank you guys. Oh. Yeah, I had fun. I hope you had a great time. Kasi uh, lagi akong ano eh, lagi akong nanonood lang. And it's <laughs> weird, pero I'm happy to be on this side of the studio. We're we are in a good way. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Ay, magiging permanent ka lang, sabi dun, no? Ayun, oh. Ah, talaga. Oo. So guys, okay. sa mga darating na linggo, magkakaroon ng mga AVP, mga pang intro video. Abangan nyo na yung kay Ella. <laughs> Yung kay Adrian, yung kay Sa, di ba? Speaking of oh. videos, ha, you can always watch us on YouTube, uh, Facebook. We yes. have our uh, Facebook page, uh, Gen and Millennial TV. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel para hindi rin kayo malate dun sa mga previous episodes ng Millennial TV, di ba? And on cable, we are on channel uh, 73. Yes, ayan. Catch us every Sundays, 8 p.m. And this is... Millennial, Millennial TV! TV. This, this is our time! time.